Hello again, my name is Gabe Zona. This is the 18th of March, 2018. One of my friends from the East Coast sent me a rather interesting, somewhat informative, and rather frightening video. It was published by Israeli News Live, and it was put up on March the 17th, 2018. The title, U.S. Navy prepares to strike Syria over false flag chemical attack. The U.S. Navy is poised all around Syria from the East Mediterranean to the Persian Gulf. Russia, MOD, says the U.S. has trained for the hottest near al Tanf in the use of chemical weapons and is anticipating a false flag attack to justify the strike. Does this sound at all familiar? When Turkey, I believe, did the same thing? They used chemical weapons on the Syrians and they blamed Bashar al-Assad? Folks, have we been focused on North Korea when we should have been looking at Syria? Who's allies with Bashar al-Assad? Vladimir Putin. He's allies with Bashar al-Assad. What do you think will happen if the United States Navy sends their attack planes off the aircraft carriers to bomb Syria? Folks, I don't know if President Trump did the right thing by giving various departments, including the military, the right to do what they feel is necessary without consulting with Congress. Congress is pretty much useless, but there's still certain protocols that have to be adhered to, are there not? I'm hoping that this isn't real. I'm hoping that Israeli News Live is mistaken, but I'm inclined to think not. The United States wants what Bashir al-Assad has, vast oil reserves and vast mineral reserves. Nothing's changed. The United States has always been interested in regime change when it suits the United States. Not the people of the United States, just the ruling class. Have you sort of noticed? You want to listen to this video. It's 11 minutes and 25 seconds in duration. And then you let me know what you think. I've already told you what I think. Watch the clip. Frightening. We're just being led like sheep to the slaughter, aren't we?